I can't wait to take my sailboat out soon, but before I do, I have to do a repair to the trailer. The boat's, the boat's doing fine. Um, it's ready. It's calling for the water. But unfortunately, my, my bunk boards here, the bracket has basically rusted up completely. On this side, it's bad, but on the other side, it's worse. I actually, it's completely come off. It's not attached anymore, which is why I have this ratchet strip, which has come loose, is, was holding it on to get it back to the dock. So let's make some new brackets. A two by six board, about 19, expensive. Carpet, about 25 bucks. The stainless steel hardware, about 15. And then the brackets themselves, about $18 all together. And then I'll, a little extra, spray some liquid roller on it to keep it moving. And then some primer to keep the brackets from rusting as much. Let's get started. Originally, I was going to build maybe a little platform or some kind of jack system to get my boat off the trailer so I could work on the bunk boards. But then I said, you know what? I think it'll be okay. Those straps already held to get it home the one time I went. I'm just going to drive it out to the, to the boat ramp, put the boat in the water, and then just, then just work on it, work on the trailer while the boat's sitting at the dock, and then I'll just go sailing for the day. So... Here we go, let's head over to the Potomac and see if we can get it working. So we got the boat off, it's down there sitting at the dock. Now we're gonna work on the trailer. We gotta fix this thing, that way we can get the boat back home. We took up the straps already. Now this is what I mean about how loose this one was. You see, this is all it was doing, it was just sitting there. The bracket had completely rusted through. 
We just need to get this off somehow. I've got a hammer, some pliers, some chisels. I'm just gonna bang off this. See if this top bracket will I gotta get out of my way so I can get to the bolt here. All right, now I'm gonna see what can I do with this thing? Will it even turn? That's the real question. tighter there we go nice all right so we got it it wasn't that bad uh, it just was a little stuck on there but we'll put the new one on we'll scrape this down nice and good clean it up maybe even spray some metal primer on there it looks like maybe superficial rust so not too bad now we just need to do that four more times that was actually a little bit easier than we thought it was going to be uh, a number of these bolts come over here gloria were uh they pretty nasty looking they were basically welded on with uh with rust but we just bang them out use the pliers a little you can see how eaten up this one got from the pliers just had to really crank them down um so we're almost done we're going to clean it up and put the new ones on we're kind of cleaning them up a little bit then we'll wipe them down and then we'll install the new hardware on them actually look much better now just to give you an idea here's our new bracket here's the old one so it look pretty pretty grungy uh, putting on the brackets not all the way tight right now just uh, tight enough so that they're straight and then we'll put the boards on we'll try to put the carpet on we just have it clamped right now and then we will uh, if you can see in there we'll drill a couple of pilot holes we'll probably just spray some more primer on this after we're done I think maybe maybe not um, and then what we've done on this one is we've gone ahead and placed it on the bracket and then made little circles for where the we drill them in and then drilled it because on the last one our drill holes were a little bit skewed so they'll go a little straighter here so we'll find out if it works or not nice just doing the final touches on the boards i sprayed some more liquid roller I wanted the, I guess you could call it the grain of, of the carpet to go this way. That way the boat slides on easier because it's usually pretty good getting it off, but I think that'll help. Check it out. Now the trailer looks kind of ugly, but these bunk boards are new. They seem like they're on the pretty solid. We left them a little loose so that the boat could sit on them and shape them to how, they, how the boat wants it. And then we'll tighten them up from there. Here are the old ones. Remember how nasty these looked? Look at the rust on there. Come on, Gloria, show us what these new brackets look like. Look at that. We've primed the metal here. We've got stainless steel hardware up on the wood. And maybe we'll spray down some more primer on that when it's nice and dry and clean one day. It's going to be awesome. Well, we had to take the boat to the dock to get it fixed anyway, to get the trailer fixed. So might as well just go for a little... We'll sail while you're at it, right? Wind finally picked up a little. We got the sun coming out on our way back. Awesome. Okay, guys, we uh, oh, there you go, you got me. So uh, we were we were out um, sailing. It got a little dark, but we just put the boat on the trailer. Let's take a look, see how those bunk boards look. Okay. Oh. All right, it's holding on there pretty good. It slid on really well with the the winch, better than it's ever slid before. So that roll on stuff on its own was well worth it. The bracket's looking pretty uh, brackety. We'll make sure we spray it down real good when we get home. Ah, oh, so much better than the last one. Nice. It's like a new boat. See you guys next time. All right, just got back home. It's about an 
hour drive with the new bunk boards and so far everything seemed pretty solid they actually uh, you probably can't see anything in here I should have brought a flashlight but uh, the the boat actually felt a lot different and sounded a lot different as I was driving when I went over a, a bump or something it was like a big thud and not as much of a squeak and not as much rocking either just it felt a lot more solid driving so I'm really pleased with them so far and of course next time I take it out I'll inspect them uh, you know make sure they're still looking okay but overall very successful little trip there